What's up lords and ladies, welcome back to another video on this channel. So in my last video, I kind of explained what I'm doing in this video, but in case you guys didn't watch it, um, what is going to happen is that me and another YouTuber that goes by the name of ER Bros, many of you guys may know him because he also does reptile videos um, and really good ones as well. We decided that we're going to do a competition to see who could make the best crusted gecko enclosures, wait for it, using only dollar store items yeah now if you guys don't know that is quite a challenge because the dollar store does not sell things for reptiles let alone for crusted geckos so we're basically going to be building something to see if we could actually you know <laughs> put a crusted gecko in there even though we're not going to put our crusted geckos actually in there we're kind of just doing this for entertainment and at the same time you guys are going to be the ones that determine who is the winner and how you guys are going to do that is basically whoever gets the most likes in their videos um whether it's me whether it's him and he has more subscribers than me so right now is the time if you guys are loyal if you guys are loyal to this channel bro we we gotta win <laughs> i think it's gonna be a fun time for us and also a fun time for you guys so let us know in the comments down below as well if you guys would like to see us do something like this or what reptile you guys would like to see us do a challenge like this of it could e it doesn't even have to be from the dollar store it could be from anywhere else we who could make the best enclosure right so at the end of the day we're just gonna go with the flow uh and just have fun so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video because right now i actually have to go to the dollar store and start this build so without further ado let's get started with this crusted gecko dollar store build let's go okay so we're right now here at the dollar store and there's so many things like look at this this, this thing is like a rat right but to be honest like there's so many things that i could choose from but like imagine this being inside of the enclosure <laughs> so i really need to narrow it down of what i need and not get crazy with it and just get like a random thing like a hand right here so we'll see what we could find now nah, wait orale homie no I, I know this is not part of the 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 <laughs> the budget but since when did they start selling tacos homie orale way and arroz oh my goodness yo bro you can have a whole meal here okay now i do see some plants that i do like like this one right here i think i'm actually going to be taking that one maybe even this one like as you could see it's like instead of a pot so even putting this in the corner and it's only four dollars so imagine four dollars for this plant right a real plant will cost you about the same amount oh there's more here what it's like little cactus or whatever this is well, this one's cool you see, like, my, my mind is just racing with a whole bunch of stuff. Like, I could probably put this, but this looks a little bit too fake. It's too blue. Kind of want it to look more realistic. So where's the one that I grabbed? Oh, it's this one. I think this one might work. Yeah, not too bad. Now, we're not really putting our custard geckos in here. So I am going to be getting also some pawning uh, mix. So some soil, just so it looks good. Um, I wouldn't recommend, I guess, getting this one for a reptile. Even though I don't think this one is not as bad but i would stick to something that's more tailored to reptiles but since i'm not putting it in there i'm probably gonna have to grab a potting mix and you know hey if i had more time i would grow this out you know <laughs> now looking around the store these are the only bins that i could find that are basically um big enough right so i'm thinking of maybe gluing them together like this so you could see it's like a decent size and if anything, I could always glue one on top like that and then put a lid here and everything is basically going to go down and it would look something like this, I guess. But hey, I'm going to have to make it work, right? So I actually might get a bird's house, like maybe like this one and basically decorate it with like a whole bunch of stuff on it. Oh man, that's going to be look so, so cool. Like I could even get like an actual house, right? And like just decorate it with like actual stuff let's see what they have here oh my god they have like moss this is like perfect now to glue everything together i'm thinking of getting this glue gun even if i get a smaller one it'll probably be best because this one's huge and i also need some glue sticks i'm going to take two packs so that right there's a dollar each 
right and I'm probably gonna look for a smaller glue gun I know that they have it somewhere okay so there's so many things here but what in the world is this honestly like could the world get any more lazier like I think I actually need this you know <laughs> I'm not putting it inside of the crusty gecko, but this, this girl looks like she's just chilling, you know. Orale, homie, look. Since when did the dollar store start to selling chancletas, way? Yo, these look comfortable. Okay, so quick wrap up. The things that I purchased, or the things that I'm getting right now, is, you know, a couple of these plants to put in the corner of the enclosure. I'm using this as the bin, and we also have some moss, glue sticks, and a glue gun. Um, some rocks and of course that little thing that I plan on making it it's hide at the top corner so There's not a lot of stuff here, but if you do look around you will find some interesting things. So hopefully I could find uh, <laughs> Something that I could use I really don't know what he's doing right now So I'm thinking of actually calling him and seeing what he's up to if he even is awake Right, so I'm gonna actually message him. I send him a text message. Um, hopefully he replies and he video chats. That way we could see what he is up to. But I still have a lot of things to purchase. Okay, so I just finished buying everything that I needed from the dollar store. So right now I need to go home and basically start this build. So see you guys when I get home. Let's go. Zoom. And just like that, I am inside of my reptile room. Now, all over my room, <laughs> there's stuff that I basically got from the dollar store. You know, I got, uh, I, I don't even know where to start. So I have the bins here. I'm gonna do the basically the 3-0. Uh, I'm gonna try to glue it all together. Hopefully, it actually turns out to be good. But I also have all of this other stuff. Like I have this plant, got some moss, some rocks, got some sticks. Chancletas. Oh, okay. So I just got this text message saying, Really, damn, um, already ahead of me. LOL, I'm still crawling out of bed. I'll call you in a bit. This is the competition right here. This, 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 look, look at the time. <laughs> oh my goodness, look who's calling. What, what, what could this guy want? Yo, what up, what up? what's up? What you doing? Okay, so this right here is my competition, as you can see. I did it look so nice, bro. You don't know. Like, I went shopping yesterday. You better prepare for this, bro. Oh my goodness, you see? Oh no, he, he, does, he, doesn't know, he doesn't know what's coming. He doesn't know what's coming. Oh, I want you guys to vote. Like, this thing's gonna look amazing. Yeah, so, so be sure if, if, if you think that his thing looks really good and everything. Um, just give it a dislike, but if you think... <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, that's not your enclosure, you liar. Nah, look at that. What is, uh, what is this? So I just finished speaking to Edwin um, through video, and he is just getting started right now, and I have all of the stuff that I basically need to make my enclosure. So, without further ado, let's get started with this build. Let's go. So check out the hide that I made for my crusted gecko. Now this is using all dollar store stuff. So you ready? Are you ready? Ready? Three, two, one. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Oh my god. <laughs> so as you can see, um, if I put this inside of my crusted gecko's enclosure, chances are he's probably going to go inside of here. I could put some moss in there or some eco earth and he could just sit there and rest. 
and then he could come out anytime that he wants and I'm thinking of putting this like at the top corner um, of the enclosure we have some moss at the top I had to glue each and individually these rocks and oh man so I'm really happy on how this turned out um, but there's still so much left of me to build so let's continue look at this <laughs> but yeah I decided to go and ahead and like glue them together so this thing is like nice and solid and from here all I need to do is just add everything to it so here we go Just put on the lid. All right. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Oh my, 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 my. <laughs> now, all of this I put, you know, work into this and I got everything from the dollar store. Check this out. Let me just give you a quick tour. So, we got a nice little tiny separation from. You know the white rocks we got like some brown rocks right there we also have this nice little tiny decoration right in the middle and you see that right there that right there is the crusted geckos hide <laughs> so with that one i actually had to put in a lot of different types of rocks glue them all together and then on top i put the roof being moss now these suction cups I actually got them there you know those dips but I actually bought like a whole bunch and I just put suction cups onto the side and that's where I'm gonna put rapashi and also the water dish and I also added some sticks that I wrapped around with rope and I also got this at the dollar store and I basically just did the exact same thing and my goodness this thing actually turned out to be pretty cool and all under $30 are you serious? Aside from that, I'm gonna give this enclosure a nice little tiny slow motion montage. Let's go. done now as you can see it is not too bad for $30 I got to build this and I'm actually thinking of keeping it because as you can see it like fits perfectly where I have it right here and you know I did use three different bins to build this and I just glued it 
cut the bottom so it's a perfect height for a crusted gecko even has a little tiny hide right there that I also had to put rocks all over put moss on top so it is not too bad I'm actually pretty happy on how it turned out even has a little tiny food dish and water dish that has like attached right there like bro I, I thought of this like <laughs> really really thoroughly so I'm really happy and satisfied on how it turned out. I don't know how Edwin is doing. I'm actually gonna message him. Oh, <laughs> so I just messaged um, Edwin basically being like, I'm done. And this is what he, he sent me. This is what he sent me. Bro, you don't even know what's coming. Oh my goodness, the company, yo, you, you don't know what's coming. You, you don't know what's, <laughs> oh, wait, actually if you're watching this video, you already technically know. I had a fun time um, making this. I can't wait to actually see his and see um, and get a good laugh and everything, but hey, <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But it's actually a very fun thing to do, especially with another person who's doing very similar videos like me and we're kind of just collabing. Um, so if you want to see more videos like this, give this video a thumbs up because if you give this video a thumbs up, you're voting for me. So if you support me, come on, you have to vote for me. You're, you're watching this video. You might as well, man. You need to give this video a like. You need to give this video a like. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, um, like I said, give it a thumbs up. Oh my goodness. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. Man, I'm really happy on how this actually turned out. It's actually pretty cool that this thing only costs thirty dollars but hold on there's one more thing missing on this oh my goodness oh!